Hello everyone, welcome to Static GK Quiz number 166. This video is aimed to help you with your central and state government job examinations. I'm with Trisha from GK today and I'll be taking you through this. The first session of Constituent Assembly took place on which of the following dates? The correct answer is 9 to 23rd December 1946. So this took place in Constitutional Hall in New Delhi. Sachin Nananda Sinha was the first president of the Constituent Assembly. In the first meeting, the Assembly adopted an objective resolution, which later became the preamble of the Constitution. Which part of the Indian Constitution deals with trade, commerce and intercourse within the territories of India? The correct answer is Part 13. Part 13, Trade, Commerce and Intercourse within the Territory of India article, uh, which is the main article that deals with these sort of things. Which among the following provisions of Indian Constitution have been taken from the Weimar Constitution of Germany? The correct answer is emergency and its effects on fundamental rights. Other borrowed ideas include the parliamentary form of government from the British Constitution, fundamental rights from the US Constitution, and directive principles of state policy from the Constitution of Ireland. Who was the interim president of First Constituent Assembly? The correct answer is Sachidanand Sinha. Sachidanand Sinha was an Indian lawyer, parliamentarian, and journalist. He was also a member of the Bihar Legislative Assembly. In 1946, he was named the interim president of the Constituent Assembly of India on 9 December 1946. He was replaced by Dr. Rajendra Prasad after indirect election on 11 December 1946. Which among the following amendment acts is also called a mini constitution? Correct answer is 42nd Amendment Act of 1976. It is the most comprehensive amendment to the constitution and carried out major changes, which is why it is known as the mini constitution. Who was the first chief election commissioner of India? The correct answer is Sukumar Sen. Sukumar Sen was an Indian civil servant who was the first chief election commissioner of India, serving for 21st March 1950 to 19 December 1958. Under his leadership, the election commission successfully administered and oversaw independent India's first two general elections between 1951 and 52 and in 1957. In a parliamentary system, which of the following sentences is correct? The correct answer is executive is responsible to the legislature. The constitution of India states that the executive branch of the state, that is council of ministers, shall be collectively responsible to the legislature or house of the people. This implies that the parliament should oversee the work of the government and hold it responsible for its actions and omissions. The constitution of India was ordained by which of the following? The preamble starts with we the people of India. So the people of India through the representatives in the constituent assembly are the people in charge of the constitution. So the correct answer is the people of India through the representatives in the constituent assembly. In which of the following the basic aims and objectives of the constitution are discussed? The correct answer is the preamble. The preamble to the constitution of India is a brief introductory statement that sets out guidelines to guide people and to present the principles of the document and to indicate the source from which the ordinary document derives its authority, meaning and the people. Which among the following formed the 22nd state of Indian Union? The correct answer is Sikkim. Sikkim emerged as India's 22nd state on 26th April 1975. The Sikkim State Day is observed on 16th May of every year because this was the day when the Chief Minister of Sikkim assumed office. That's all for today's quiz. Until the next video, goodbye.